buddy. Do you mind if I talk to you for a second? Oh, uh, do you mind taking those out? Could you just please take those out so that I can talk to you for a second? How may I help you? I just wanted to come check in and, and see how you're doing. Some people in the office were a little concerned. I'm doing fine. You know, I just wanted to say, uh, nobody cares that when I said casual Friday, you heard jazz Friday. <laughs> I didn't hear jazz Friday. You just brought a giant saxophone toward. I thought it looked good there. Are you gonna answer that? No, it's just my daughter. She's been calling all day. Why would you not answer it if it's your daughter? Hello, you've got John the Jazz Man coming to you live from my office this Friday. Jazz Friday, of course. <laughs> so, leave a message after this axe. Dad, where are you? It's my fucking wedding day, Dad. You hear that? Why are you not at your daughter's wedding? Is it because you thought today was Jazz Friday? No, come on! What? Hey guys, uh, happy oh JF. Oh my god. Um, do you have the uh, numbers for the... Uh, what are you, why are you dressed like this? Did you think it was Jazz Friday? I knew it was Jazz Friday. Martin, he canceled it. What? I didn't cancel Jazz Friday, okay? Jazz Friday never existed. I said casual Friday. Dude, you said Jazz Friday. I didn't say Jazz no, Friday. No, you said it was Jazz Friday. Nope. You told me and John, you said bring your instruments because tomorrow's Jazz Friday. I did not say bring your instruments. You said bring your instruments and bring a jazz attitude. Why would there be a Jazz Friday? I don't know. What is that? I, it's Dang. stupid. Stupid? Okay, give me that throat. What? <sighs> you never call Jazz Friday stupid. <sighs> Martin, we're getting out of here. No, no. Punch me in the throat, that's one thing. Leave, it's a whole other thing entirely. You don't think I wish every Friday could be Jazz Friday? Of course I do. I wish we could be dicking around, blowing horns, having fun, but we can't, we have jobs. I mean, we work in advertising, people. I don't know if you guys know this, but down in that conference room, we have three of the top executives from Fanta. Fuck. Waiting in the conference room. We're talking about the Fana account. Hello? This isn't small potatoes. <sighs> I need you guys to focus here. I guess if you think about it, advertising is a lot like jazz. <laughs> okay, all right. Yeah, tell me what you mean. There's improvisation. It's a two drink minimum. Everyone's drunk. I feel like that only applies to jazz. Well, what's something, what would you say? How about that? It's kind of like a form of entertainment. And it's the precursor of hip hop. Big part of La La Land. You're saying advertising is a precursor to hip hop? I'm, I'm saying jazz and advertising. Oh. They're two in the guys, same. Guys, guys. Uh, Fanta. Okay. Yeah. Jazz advertising. Okay. What did you just uh, say? I said jazz advertising. Why don't you guys just go in there and do your best? What's up, Fanta? Everyone, shut up. Yeah. They hated it. Shit. Did we lose the account? Yeah. Okay. I guess you can just go home then. You sure? Yeah. All right. Yep. <clears throat> Where's Martin? Huh? Where's Martin? Not sure. Have a good weekend. Martin, we need you.